guys. All right. Ah, should have started making the video a little earlier. So what I'm working on here was this bleeder was broken. So I read on the forums about uh, getting the bleeder out. And uh, it said, don't try to use an easy out because you'll crack the cast iron. So what I did was I drilled in here with a bit. I went and found my tap and die set, which I can't read any of them. I found the one inch, I found the one eighth, I found the one eighth inch pipe tap. And I uh, just got my lube. So, uh, yeah, I got some lube on there. I did spray some lube on there. And now we're going to get this started. There's a little bit of brass in there yet. Oh, back up filming this with my camera. All right, so we're, we're just turning the we're turning the brass out of there. Spray that down. Yeah, my camera skills suck. Sorry. <laughs> I don't know how guys make it so they get the perfect shot. I guess tripods. And... Anyway, I'm trying to show you what I'm what I got going on. Um, I pressure tested um, one, two, three, five radiators so far. I put fittings on them, filled them up with water, let them sit for a little while. Um, yeah, everything went good. So yeah, we're just getting the brass out of here, and uh, yeah, that was broken off. Like I said, these radiators were manhandled, so I wanted to make sure they made the they made the move. And they did. I think so far, I got five. I got three more to test, but this one here had a broken bleeder, so. Uh, yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm tapping that out. I think I got it in there enough. Don't want to force anything. And uh, let's see. Yep, there we go. I got new got got, got threads again. There's the freaking there's the brass on there. Alrighty. Now where was that bleeder I took from the other radiator? Let's see. Did we do it? Did we do it? Did we do it or didn't we do it? Well, we did, but we didn't. I see threads, but... Uh-oh. Uh-oh, I see threads, but I don't... Are these bigger than 8th inch? Hmm. Weird. Now what do I do? <laughs> wow. Yeah, what the heck? Is the old in there yet or something? Oh, it's, I got it. I guess I gotta tap more. Okay, well, anyway, I just wanted to show you what I was up to there. So I have no idea what I'm doing. Uh, but yeah, like I said, that doesn't thread in there. So I guess I have to tap deeper. It's a tapered tap. Yeah, I don't wanna force it, I don't wanna break anything, but yeah, we'll lube it up some more and go at it some more. Okay, we'll get the thing, but anyway, let me get back to what I'm doing and uh, I'll give everybody an update. I got, I got a friend coming to help me tomorrow morning move some of these radiators into the rooms. Mom's been busting butt, trying to clear stuff. 50 years of the stuff in this house, 52 years actually. So, yeah, these don't exactly, uh, these aren't exactly small, but hey, I'm happy to get them. 30 bucks a piece of paid for them. So, yeah, that was, that's where we're at on that one. And it just won't right, rain. And I got good news there's no water in my basement, none. It's dry. Everybody was worried that my boiler was going to rot away down there. <laughs> that last section of wall that leaked, I got. And there's a front, the front wall leaks yet too, but it has to be like monsoon season. I'll get that fixed. I'll be down there a lot looking at my EFM running, so go mix some freaking uh, cement up and do wall repairs while I'm down there all winter. Okie dokie. So yeah, this is a five section. Uh, yeah, that big one there is going in the dining room. Um, there's a small one there next under the window there. Not small, it's not, not exactly small. That one's going in my son's room. Um, one next to it's going in the living room. The one next to that's going upstairs in my room. That one there, the tall one further out, that's going in the front bathroom. That one there might be going in my room. Um, this one's going to be going into the library, middle room, whatever you want to call it. This one's going into my mom's room. And this one's going into the basement. And I got to find two small, two more, I have to find two more small radiators. So, yeah, that's what I'm up to. Bought myself a new pipe wrench, too, aluminum. 
Uh, I wanted to buy an American made one, but it was like they were $52 versus $19 for the, the China Pop. Uh, I hate to do it, but you know, I don't, I'm not a plumber. <laughs> probably, uh, this will probably get used a couple times in my lifetime, so I got the cheaper one, unfortunately. But, uh, alrighty, I'm gonna try to stay dry here. Out here in this nasty rain. Look at that view, that's the view from my front porch. Love it out here. So anyway, I'll talk to you guys all later and uh, take care.